as a business owner, you have many responsibilities to worry about. You need to keep your employees motivated and happy, develop new products or services for the company, manage customer feedback and satisfaction levels, the list goes on. One thing that is often overlooked in this process is marketing. Marketing is so important because it's what drives sales. If no one knows about your product or service, then how will they buy it? It's crucial that you outsource your chief marketing officer to grow your company successfully. This video will discuss why outsourcing makes sense for most companies and provide tips for working with an outsourced CMO successfully. What is a CMO? A chief marketing officer is the head of marketing for a company. Their responsibilities include developing and running marketing campaigns to drive sales, responsible for client satisfaction and retention through customer service interactions. This includes answering questions about products, services or problems with purchases, creating and managing a company's brand, overseeing market research to determine customer needs, wants and competitors' strategies, looking out for new marketing opportunities and trends. The obvious reason to outsource your CMO is that you're a business owner. You have more important things to do than spend all day writing emails, creating advertisements, or researching industry trends. If your company has grown large enough that these tasks are taking up too much of your time, it's time to outsource. Another reason to outsource your CMO is that you need someone with specific skills and knowledge. It's hard to find someone who has all of the skills required for this position, such as experience in market research, branding, advertising, and customer service. Outsourcing allows you to bring on a specialist who can help your company reach its full potential. Why should you outsource your CMO? Outsourcing your CMO can be an excellent decision for any business. Here are four reasons why you should outsource your CMO. You're too busy running the rest of your business and don't have time to manage a marketing department. You want expert advice from marketing professionals who know what they're doing. You outsource to save time, money, and frustration. Your business doesn't stop when you go on holiday or have a day off. Marketing is a 24-7 job so it's essential to have someone who can take care of things when you're not available. Outsourcing your CMO means that you can relax and enjoy your time off without having to worry about whether your marketing efforts are still being taken care of. Outsourcing also allows businesses to outsource to professionals who are experts in their industry. Marketing is the same as any other business out there. Whether you're selling cars, food, or computers, outsource to those people who know what they're doing. You can focus on making your product better without worrying about marketing it all by yourself. Instead, outsource and let the experts do what they're good for selling your product. How do you find the right outsourced CMO? There are two ways to outsource your chief marketing officer, through an agency or a freelancer. Each option has its own set of pros and cons, so it's important to weigh them carefully before making a decision. Outsourcing your chief marketing officer to an agency. Outsourcing through an agency can be helpful if you need access to a wide range of marketing services. Agency pricing models vary but they will likely charge you an upfront fee of between $2,000 and $50,000. You'll then be billed on a retainer basis, depending on the scope of your project. A typical outsourced marketing agency has experts in each major area of digital marketing, including SEO, SEM, social media, content marketing, web design, and more traditional marketing channels like PR, market research, and advertising, because the agency has a team of experts in each area. They can help you develop a cohesive marketing strategy that covers all your bases. In addition, an agency will have more experience dealing with large brands and will be better equipped to handle complex projects. The main downside to outsourcing through an agency is that you'll be paying out a retainer on an ongoing basis. So if the agency cannot deliver results in any particular area, it may take months for your money back. It's also worth noting that many agencies will bill out at higher rates than freelancers because they have senior staff with years of experience under their belts and can thus command a higher price. Outsourcing your chief marketing officer to a freelancer. Freelancers are typically less expensive than agencies, with rates starting at around $500 per month for basic services. They may also be called VCMOs, or virtual chief marketing officers. The main benefit of working with a freelancer is getting more personalized service. A good freelance CMO will take the time to understand your business and what you're hoping to achieve, then craft a marketing strategy specifically for you. Freelancers also have more flexibility than agencies regarding working hours and project timelines. If you need something done urgently, a freelancer is likely to accommodate you. On the downside, freelancers typically don't have the same breadth of experience as an agency so they may not be able to handle more complex projects. They also don't have a team of experts behind them, which means you may need to outsource additional services separately. Overall, the decision of whether to outsource your CMO through an agency or a freelancer depends on your budget and how much you're willing to spend out of pocket. If your budget is tight, a freelancer may be the best option for you. If money is an issue and you're looking for more flexibility in terms of working hours, Collaborating with an agency can be helpful because they have senior staff who are used to managing large projects on a tight timeline. 
whatever you decide, make sure to do your research and ask for referrals from friends or colleagues who have outsourced their CMO in the past. The wrong decision could end up costing you more time and money in the long run. The benefits of outsourcing your CMO. There are several benefits to outsourcing your CMO. You gain access to marketing expertise that may be outside of your organization's reach by outsourcing. Additionally, you can tap into new trends and strategies that may be more difficult to implement in-house. Outsourcing also allows you to focus on your core business while a third party handles your marketing strategy. This can help you cut costs by not having to outsource other services, such as in accounting. The most significant benefit of outsourcing comes in the form of cost savings by giving a third party firm control over your CMO position. They will be able to maximize their resources while minimizing management expenses on your end. A third party firm will have access to a broader network of experts resulting in lower costs on your part. Additionally, you can outsource overseas and gain access to less expensive labor markets without worrying about cultural or language barriers that may be difficult for in-house staff. Other benefits include greater efficiency through outsourcing and a better understanding of your target market. The CMO will evaluate the needs and wants of your customers, allowing you to create a product or service that meets those demands. By outsourcing, you receive access to new ideas without paying for expensive in-house talent. You can save money by outsourcing specific services such as SEO writing, graphic design, and website design while still getting a high quality product. You also don't have to worry about the time it would take to train someone in-house on your company's specific marketing strategies. When looking for a CMO outsourcing partner, it is essential to find a firm with experience working with companies of your size. If you outsource to a small firm, they may not have the resources needed to create high quality work. Likewise, if you outsource your CMO position to an enterprise with greater marketing experience than yours, their ideas and strategies may be difficult for in-house employees or freelancers working on lower budgets to implement. The risks of outsourcing your CMO. When it comes to outsourcing your CMO, there are a few risks that you need to be aware of. First and foremost is that you may not get the same level of expertise or experience as you would if you hired someone in-house. Additionally, by outsourcing your marketing efforts, you lose out on building a relationship with your CMO and having them be fully invested in your company. Finally, outsourcing can be expensive and it may not be the best use of your resources. Expertise, the double-edged sword. When you outsource your CMO, you are essentially hiring an expert to help you with your marketing efforts. While this can be a great thing, it can also be a double-edged sword. On the one hand, you get access to someone who has a lot of experience and knows what they're doing. However, on the other hand, you won't be able to build a relationship with your CMO. If you outsource, there's always the chance that the person who takes over for your marketing representative isn't as good at their job or doesn't have quite enough time on their hands because they're splitting it up between multiple clients. Also, since you don't know them, they may be harder to trust them with confidential information. The relationship factor, when you have an in-house CMO, they are fully invested in your company and want to see it succeed. They work hand in hand with other members of your team to create a cohesive marketing strategy that meets your overall business goals. Outsourcing your CMO means that you lose out on this critical relationship. You may also find it more challenging to get help or feedback since they're not as invested in your company as someone employed by you. The cost factor, hiring an in-house CMO can be expensive. And it's something that you need to take into account when you're out looking for a new CMO. Outsourcing your marketing efforts is generally more cost effective than hiring someone. However, it's still something that will cut into your budget, and there may be additional costs involved in terms of the time spent on finding and vetting candidates. Outsourcing your CMO can be a risky proposition. You may not get the same level of expertise or experience. You lose out on the ability to build a relationship with your CMO, and it can be expensive. It's essential to weigh all of these factors before deciding whether or not to outsource your marketing efforts. The cost of outsourcing your CMO. When it comes to marketing, many companies choose to outsource their CMO. While this can be an excellent option for some businesses, it's not always the cheapest way to go. Outsourcing your CMO can often cost more than hiring someone in-house. Several factors play into the cost of outsourcing your CMO. First, you need to consider the cost of hiring an outsourced company for your marketing activities. Often, outsourced companies require you to sign a long-term contract that can be very expensive if you aren't happy with their work. When it comes time to end this agreement, most outsourced companies charge hefty fees to break the deal. Additionally, it would help to think about the cost of lost productivity. When you outsource your CMO, you're essentially handing over control of your marketing department to someone else. This can lead to a lot of wasted time as employees struggle to adjust to new procedures and protocols. In some cases, it can even lead to decreased productivity as employees lose motivation and focus. Other outsourced companies promise quick, easy solutions to your marketing problems that don't exist. Many outsourced companies will make promises about their performance before you even sign a contract with them such as guaranteed results or specific conversion rates for ads placed on certain websites. Be sure to review outsourcing company guarantees carefully before making any decision.